right, what are we going to talk about this week for the motivational thought of the week? I got my little trusty book of quotes here. A Forbes thought of the day this week. And uh, the quote is from Jacques de Lille. De Lille. Jacques de Lille. Fate chooses our relatives, we choose our friends. I don't believe I've done this one before. If I have, for the hardcore listeners, damn it, Ryback, you've already said this quote. I apologize. Big dumb wrestler, can't remember. It's a book of quotes and I bounce around, guys. I should probably mark the ones that I use, but I also think I have a good memory, which at times I really do, but there are times where I could just completely botch this and redo a quote, which hopefully I, I speak very similarly how I did originally if I did. But fate chooses our relatives, we choose our friends. I'm looking to make sure if I want to do this one. Yeah, I do. I want, I want to stay on this one. Fate chooses our relatives, we choose our friends. What does that mean? Well, the, the family we are born into is, is, is fate. It is not our choice. It is something that we are brought into this world in and the people that we are around at a young age. But as we get older uh, and we have more control, um, we get to determine who we get to call, we want to call our friends or who we want to associate with. And I think that's really important for us to realize that and the power that we hold each and every day, that I think it's extremely important. And not just because we hear successful people say it and whatnot, but I think it's really important to take a step back and look at our lives and the people who are closest to us. And if we are not happy about something, if we feel that there's somebody or some group of people that are not necessarily beneficial for ourselves or what we are trying to do, one, I think it's important to have a conversation if it's something that is, if it's someone that is important and that you do feel you would like to keep around and try uh, to remedy the situation. And if that doesn't work, and then you have to Understand that you have the power to say, you know what, I wish you the best, but I don't think you're best for my life. And there's nothing wrong with that. And it's because it's, we truly, the people that we choose to surround ourselves with and uh, the environment that we are in, no matter how positive our mindset may be, if you're around a group of, you know, really negative down people that find the worst in everything that only want to talk about other people and whine and complain and it's really not going to be beneficial for you and it what happens is is their problems be start becoming your problems and it can happen subconsciously really quickly so it, it is and there might be other aspects of that person that you like but it's you gotta it's you have the power at the end of the day you have to and i think it comes down to you have to know what you want i think a lot of us don't know what we want and we just go with the flow And we don't really take the time to understand things. Instead, we distract ourselves with technology, video games, food, porn, different things to take our mind off of our problems rather than just putting our attention on our problems and actually finding real happiness because it's not in this stuff to solve our problems. And we hear that all the time. Well, well, I love watching wrestling because it lets me forget about my problems. It lets me, allows me to take my mind off of the the everyday stresses of life. Okay, that's great. But at some point, you're going to have to focus on your problems, focus on the people that you're around. And if you want to improve, it's your choice if you don't want to. But I I just think it's important to understand that we all have that power inside of us. And uh, um, when we get to a certain point, even if it's relatives and you don't get along with them and you don't think they're beneficial, there's nothing wrong. It is, you're not mean, you're not, but distancing yourself in a way is where you're not exposed to that and putting yourself around like-minded people that, that put out good energy, that, that, that have good intentions that, you know, you can benefit them be, by being around in their existence and they can benefit you by, by being, by being around you. So it's, um, it's not difficult, but we really make things difficult at times. But I really like that quote. So that's my thought of the day with that. 
Guys, I thank you very much for listening as always. I'm going to go ahead and run through a few things here to, to wrap up this week's show. All fan mail, please send to P.O. Box 752740, Las Vegas, Nevada, 89136. For all personal videos, cameo.com slash the big guy Ryback. Book the big guy at yahoo.com uh, for any inquiries on anything. I'm not really traveling or doing anything, but if you have anything, any uh, podcast request uh, for different things or interviews, please reach out to book the big guy at yahoo.com. Ryback TV. I believe we are approaching 150,000 subscribers. Thank you guys very much for that. That's youtube.com slash Ryback TV. My motivational book, Wake Up at the Feeding Time, available on Amazon in paperback, Audible, and Kindle formats. And signed copies are available on feedmemore.com. Follow me on social media. I am the big guy Ryback22 on Instagram. Feed me more nutrition on Instagram. Conversation with the big guy Ryback on Instagram, Twitter at Ryback22, Facebook at Feed Me More Nutrition, and Snapchat Ryback247. Thank you guys very much for listening. How do I mess up the word listening? Thank you very much for Thank you very much for listening. Feed me more. Hey guys, it's the big guy Ryback, and I just want to say thank you very much for watching. Go ahead and punch that like, smash that subscribe button, and check out my all-natural su- my all-natural supplement line. Supplement, supplement. Stupid. My all-natural supplement line. Feed me more nutrition. Available on Amazon and feedmemore.com. And as always, Conversation with the Big Guy Ryback, available on all podcast platforms, iTunes, Google Play, SoundCloud, and wherever podcasts are available. Never forget, feed me more. Thank you for tuning in to this segment of Ryback's Conversation with the Big Guy. Watch full episodes here on YouTube. Subscribe if you're new. Smash that like button if you had a great time watching. And for all supplements, check out feedmemore.com.